Hey, what's going on for the second time frame? And the second time frame is talking about surprises and changes from the past that's going to be coming in. I feel like you're undecided in a situation with someone. You're going back and forth with them emotionally. You're still letting them have to... What? Go ahead. What is it? You can use the headset. Go ahead. Come on. I can't see you. What you want? You hungry? Tell me. Tell me. Go ahead. You can't wait. <laughs> You can't wait in here to disturb the video for this that's said. Right. Okay, don't be doing that. If you're going to say it, speak on it. I'm not doing never minds. Whatever you got to say, you need to say it or I won't hear it. <laughs> so, here we go with changes. I do see something. If you're owed any kind of income, that's going to be coming in for you. I feel like whatever it is that's coming back to you financial wise, it is short term. I do see so you thinking about your responsibilities. There's one thing that is over for you, okay? It's one thing that's over for you, and I think you don't like it, but you're still keeping your eyes on what happened with that and how it came about. Uh, when it comes down to relationships, you're just going to have to just put that on the back burner because he or she is not your friend at this time. I do see celebrations coming in. You're, you're teaming up with somebody, or you have someone around you that keeps causing you losses. Please get with that. Smiling faces is causing problems. The second time I've seen this individual here, there's a message is coming to your home that's going to make you upset. You got somebody around you that's really sweet. It just keeps coming off wrong. For some reason, I don't think, I think they're nice, but maybe you're not getting what they're saying. Or it's like it's almost coming off wrong. I don't think you understand them. Because it doesn't seem like they're trying, whatever they're saying, they're not saying for this type of reaction. You're not listening, I think, in in, in the sense. Uh, um, so th th there's continued losses with this individual. So I do see that you are at a peace with someone or looking at someone at a peace. More, more income's coming your way in May. Relationships are not your friend again at that time point. Leave love alone. Stay with the focus of accounting. Something with Chase Bank or something with banking is coming up for you in accounting. I think I do think you're going to walk in that door in a good way. Endings with any type of new situations that are coming. Do not try to re-embark something. Do not try to raise anything back up. This card is, the, this last three months is about you deciding to walk back into a door again that's shutting. You're gonna make several attempts to do it. You're gonna say you're gonna have you're gonna you're having several money making decisions about it. Someone's giving someone's talking to you or someone's around you that's really, really nice and sweet. I don't think that they're trying to cause you issues. I don't think you're listening. Because whatever it is with this person, I see the person is good, the person is loving, there's good intentions. It's the way that you're processing it. Because sometimes when you're processing what you want against what another mind is telling you, it is, if you're not open to listening to another direction, it will collide with you. It's going to seem like a loss because it's almost like you're going in reverse. It's, I don't think you're listening and understanding. It's, it's, it, whatever they're telling you, it's not supposed to go that way. And it's, it's almost like causing you a loss. You're making moves without listening. Listen. Whoever this is, listen. Because I think this, this, this is encouragement. It's like encouragement. It, it's not even that. It's like this person is they're going to be who they are regardless. Listen and process and then let things, let things happen before you make decisions this just keeps saying it over and over again you're trying to walk back in a door that has it's going to be shutting probably at the end of march going by april the 7th that door is going to be shut or it already has been shut i want to give you a little advice about not listening in your situation by you turning the knob on that door and opening it everything that was around you is in that door not only that you want to walk back in that door but in every situation so it wasn't it wasn't closing because it wasn't for you. It was closing because of things that was around it that was affecting you. It was gonna walk out of your hands anyway because of the people that was around it. You see what I'm saying? You can't have nothing for yourself if everybody is in it with a ten cent. You wasn't making the decision you needed to make. You wasn't the authority figure in it. You didn't take care of it. You didn't execute it. You didn't make it your own. Close the door. The advice that was given to you was really good advice. The first time, it's one of your friends that's around you. I don't think that you blamed them for it. It just didn't turn. You didn't, do, you didn't listen it didn't, and it came off. And that's why I was like, leave this person alone. And then I see this person come around again and they're just sitting there. It's because they're giving you, they're giving it to you and you're taking what you want out of it and trying to make those, like, like taking a magic pill and trying to make it open. The door was going to open. It's going to swing close again.
Okay, so this is about you rewalking into another door, okay? And you're trying to reopen it and it's shut. No matter what you do, it ain't gonna open back up. It's gonna, it's like it's like a flat air and pump it, pump it, pump it back up and and pump it, pump it, pump it, pump it, pump it back up. It's gonna keep doing that. So I think that you've kind of opened it because I see a lot of stuff that I thought we got rid of in March. I'm gonna say it like it is. It looks like you're about to repeat a cycle. You're going to go through March again. You're going to go through March again. And I'm, I know you feel it coming. I know you feel the drag. That drag is past energies. If the box say shut. And you scared you're going to lose something. When, when doors are closed baby. You leave them you leave them closed. You don't listen to nobody else. You do what the Lord tell you to do. If you You can't be afraid to lose. That's one thing. You can you cannot do scared business. You have to be able to lose. If you're gonna be in business and you and you think you're always gonna win, you ain't doing no business. You just playing the game. And we don't need no play the games. We need cheerleaders. We need everybody has to take a position. Everyone, you're gonna have to take this loss and accept it. I'm talking about the closed doors. I'm not talking about the doors that are balancing. It is up to you to raise it. You can't raise none of this. The best thing that's going to happen out of this situation that you will not close the door on is all that bullshit from the past. It's going to hit you again and it's going to tear you down. Ask me about it and I tell you. Leave it alone. Don't do it. And you know I wouldn't lie to you. Or I try to do my best. I've been through something like this before. And it ain't cute. And you're going to repeat it every time because it, it becomes an addiction. It becomes something that you like. And every day I wake up, I can't do it without it. And I like when they tell me no. I like when they tell me, yeah, I like it. You definitely need to watch The Rebel. Because it's all about that. That, that moves when it's fucking you up. It's nothing wrong with feeling like something's been taken from you. Because with this situation, there is a feeling of loss and loneliness here. No, 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 no. Recognize it. That's what I always tell people. See it, feel it, and be it. Recognize that energy. Recognize this thing that's been taken away from you. Review the case. Rev bang, bang. Shout out to Miss Diaz. I love Diaz so much. She's so cute. I love Diaz. I love Diaz. I love everything about her. I love it. I love her. I love her. I love her. I love her. I, love her. I just love that. Libra thing. She got she got it strong. She got it real strong too. I like it. She 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 is not afraid. She's herself. She's not afraid to embrace it. Let it in. She's not afraid to make mistakes. You see what I'm saying? I'm not comparing. I'm saying that's how you gotta do it. You have to be vulnerable. You have to be open. You have to be willing to take a loss and sit on it and get back up and start something new. Ever going. You need to be a little bit more outgoing. You're too sheltered. You are spoiled as hell. And it's showing. Because you're grabbing onto the toys. And the toy, and you're getting too old for the toys. And the toys are crying. Would you please stop combing my hair? Would you please put quit putting rod rollers in my hair? Would you please quit flat under my hair? I am not your baby. I am a doll. I am something that you can get rid of and regain again. Do you understand where I'm taking you? Get rid of it. Close it. Shut it. Let it hurt. Let it pain. See it. Feel it. Be it. But let's go back to willing. So you feel like there's just a loss in here, right? There's this. See, when you're not used to standing in separation, I'm going to use it like that. When you're not used to standing in separation, it has, something that, it has to be something that is a continued feeling. You know how you do things so much, there's a natural reaction, and, and, and this is what I need from you. I need that natural reaction. So what if it ended? So what if it ended? Good. Because you must remember, Mama Sita. Don't look at what ended. Look at what ended it. And that's where you're going to get your revelation. That's where you're going to get your revel. That's where you're going to get your mood swings. How did I do it? How are you going to you embark? You got to embark, mama. Because you have to identify with what makes it feel like a loss. Because you was holding on too long to it. That's air sign stuff. We belong to it. We own it. We, you, know, you know, we're loyal. And there's nothing wrong with being that. Be that. Don't stop that. That's who you are. But when it comes to this, she got 